Welcome back to Smart ER and today I'm going to show you seven things I like about my Smart 4.4. So the first one I found by accident when I was going to make a video about where is the smart car battery because in the old one, the 451, it was in the footwell of the passenger's side. So I wondered what this was for. Now I've had this nearly 16 months. So I give it a little pull expecting to find a battery under there but Hello, no battery. What is that all about? And it's this. It's the tire inflator kit. It's the emergency get you home kit. I've been borrowing the wife's one from the BMW all the time. So you've got uh, you've got the tire inflator here. Looks like it's never been out. You've got the uh, the actual material you insert into it to inflate your tires temporarily, and the uh, the tow bar hook. Hmm. Who knew? Next one, I'm sure most people know anyway, but it does make me smile. It's just a little cubby hole. So if you needed to put your, your phone in there or a battery or a little bit of money or something safe, you've got something there. And the next one, again, just makes me smile. It's there. It's just somewhere to put my sunglasses. Really like that. Simple. The next one's practical. And most of the next ones are practical, actually. Tie-down hooks, yeah, we've all seen those. But have you ever actually looked at these ones? So if you do have something bulky, you've got the proper tie-downs here as well. You can use bungee cords or ratchet straps. Really useful. I've got a lot in the back of my car. Anyway, the next practical feature is this. And I wonder, what does this do? Because it moves. And then I realised it adjusts the load space that you have in the boot of your Smart for 4. Let me know if you've got it in the Smart for 2 as well. But it just make it from makes the rear seat instead of being a, a reclined seat, it's a bit more upright, so not very comfortable. But if you do need that little bit more room and you do need to travel a little distance with some passengers, at least you all can. And here's the difference: it doesn't look much, but it makes all the difference when you need to put something a bit more squared or rectangular in there, and you don't want it touching against the glass. So again, here is from a different angle. Yeah, you're going to be sat bolt upright, but it gets you there. This is really neat. I figured this out the other day as well. Yes, I'm stupid, but I do have my Husky and we do use this as the daily driver. So this is his waterproof cover for when all the seats are down. And you can, you've got another little storage space, so you can actually tuck it away. Perfect. Like that, a lot. And last but not least, another seating special. You can lay the front seat down and have a whole place to lay down in. You really can, head to toe. Well, I hope you enjoyed those. Please uh, like and subscribe if you found it useful. Loads more videos. Thanks, bye.